This Tavistock Braves playoff report is brought to you by Legends Tap House and Grill, a proud supporter of Doherty Division Hockey. Drop by Legends after the game or anytime at 1084 Rest Acres Road in Paris. The Tavistock Braves on home ice Friday night for Game 3 in their quarterfinal series against the Burford Bulldogs. Tavistock starting the night up 2-0 in the best of seven. And the first good opportunity goes to the Bulldogs. Taylor Kellum to Thomas Morgan. Jensen Van Bokel with a good save on the redirect. Still no score. Back the other way, a good chance for the Braves. Drew Girth rips it. Caleb Ursu with the save and he hangs on for a whistle later how about this save by Ursu he absolutely robs Tanner Johnson glove save Ursu keeping the game scoreless but in the final minute of the period loose puck in front Derek Jensen bangs it home DJ opens the scoring one nothing Tavistock after one second period now it's a long pass for Mitch McKay shorthanded break away Caleb Ursu with a big save he denies McKay still one nothing later this is Brock Phillips breaking in he sends it to Brody Oliver who buries it the Braves defenseman giving his team a two goal lead a few minutes later the puck comes back to Brock McKenzie at the point and he's got his first goal of the playoffs McKenzie making it three nothing Tavistock and they keep coming the pass for Drew Girth, quick release and a goal for Girth. That's his fourth marker of the series. 4-0 Braves. Late stages of the period. Ryan Squires chasing down the loose puck. Jensen Van Bokel comes out and it's a big collision. That causes a scrum. Squires receiving a five minute major for charging on the play. Van Bokel would be okay and stayed in the game. Third period now. Josh Helgerman to Zach Gladding. He is speeding in. Stopped by Ursu. He made 47 saves on Friday night but a little later this time Gladding won't be denied he's in the slot and it's a rocket from Gladding that goal making it 5-0 Braves and they win it by a final score of 7-0 on Friday night Tavistock now leading the series 3-0 with game four set for Sunday night back in Burford for more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.